everyone. We're just getting this place prepared to get flea bombed. We have the pest control coming out tomorrow and just going through each room and essentially just vacuuming out all the corners, all the places that the fleas like to hide. We got this broom kind of sweeping up. There's, there's some painting going on. I was doing some painting in this room and it's when I started noticing the fleas were biting. So I ended up trying to treat it myself and they kept coming back. So now I've got the, the pest control, the experts coming. So really what I'm doing is I'm just getting all the rooms prepared, all the floors, all the corners. Oh, there's a, there's a palmetto bug right there. There's a palmetto friend. Yeah, each room, each corner, you can kind of see that there's definitely some residue left behind from whoever was in here. Some of these corners are just nasty, like hair on the walls and ugh, that's, I don't even know what that is, but it's freaking disgusting. You see, we had kind of the paint started here, and that's when we had to call it quits. I kind of switched to long pants now and, and my boots because those things kept, they were biting me, and you know when the insects start biting you, then you know it's pretty bad, um, especially if your dogs are on preventative. They'll bite the dogs, and then they'll, they'll, uh, they'll die off shortly after, but... In this case, when they start biting me, that's when I know that the insects are pretty bad. And I was seeing them, I can kind of see them jumping around. Like, not now, but a couple days ago, they were kind of jumping around. So, I was working in this room, and I'm kind of putting a pause on that to take care of the uh, insect problem. And so, I'm going to vacuum this, finish up, kind of sweep it out. And then, I've got this... Uh, stuff that I'm, I kind of make a solution, ammonia cleaner, and I'm just gonna scrub the floors and kind of the, the baseboards and um, kind of get this all prepared for, for them tomorrow. It's like freaking caked to the wall. This is nasty. Absolutely disgusting. I just got this ammonia and I don't care if it takes the wallpaper or the paint down. I'm in the process of priming this thing anyways and it's gonna be a completely different color. And I also don't care too much about the floor because it's buckling in some places and if it takes the finish off then just put something else down or ultimately just trying to get rid of this it's insect problem because these bugs are getting out of hand. And so you just kind of taking this and a cleaner solution. Basically we're trying to get all the flea eggs, trying to kill those things off because they get, kind of get embedded in the little cracks there. And we really want to kind of kill all those things off so we can break that cycle of flea and just so that they don't keep coming back creating more fleas and more insects so I'm just gonna kind of go across the room here with this ammonia and hopefully this kills everything off and then we'll come in tomorrow pest control come in with the the heavy guns and hopefully that just kind of wipes everything out Ugh, you see that? It's so gross. There's like something peed and it went underneath the trim and between the wall. It's so nasty. I'm probably gonna have to take these floor trims up and see what kind of mess was underneath those.
Another palmetto bug friend. Just enough, I don't know, like just enough to cover the the floor, get all the spots where there's a little bit of pain as well while I'm at it. The idea here is fleas don't like the smell of ammonia. So by doing this, it hopefully activates or gets their senses going so when the pros come tomorrow to do their pest control, we kind of have a clean state going on here where we're not gonna miss anything. And this place is empty, it's, it's been derelict for a little while, so who knows what's been, what type of activity. Apparently I've heard that fleas go dormant when there's no animals, so they've probably just been waiting for us to get in here and start doing this work and as soon as activity started they kind of all swarmed and attacked at once. That's my guess. Um, I guess fleas can live for months in dormancy and once they start feeling vibrations of activity then, then they emerge and that's when they, they start biting. So. That's the idea of what we're doing here. Hopefully it works. Again, this is just one of the rooms. We're kind of doing this room by room. Um, and then they're gonna come tomorrow and kind of do the whole building. They're gonna do the exterior, they're gonna do the interior. They're gonna do kind of all the cracks and areas where it's hard to reach. Um, don't know exactly what they're gonna use. I guess we'll find out. Um, might be a uh, pest control or a some type of chemical. Um, they might even use the diatomaceous earth. I've seen folks that recommend that. You kind of sprinkle it. It makes a mess, but you sprinkle it all around, and then the fleas it kind of just shreds their exoskeletons when they when they walk through it or when they eat it. Um, so that's what we're doing. Flea preparation cleaning, vacuuming, and ammonia cleaner mop. We'll see what happens.